Did you know in 1977, Ohio State University received a transmission signal from outer space, and we still do not know what it came from? Let's break it down in this week's Pair Minute. On August 15, 1977, an astronomer named Jerry Amon received an unprecedented radio signature at Ohio State's Big Ear Radio Telescope. He was monitoring radio wave activity in deep space as part of the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, or SETI, when something amazing happened. The signal, which was determined to have come from within the Sagittarius constellation billions of miles away, lasted for over a minute. He made note of the inexplicable transmissions, writing WOW in the margins. Little did Amon know Know, this would set in motion decades of paranormal investigation and speculation. A signal of this type had never been seen before and has never been observed since. But where exactly did it come from? A number of theories have been proposed, but none of them really make sense. After searching for a recurrence of the signal that never came, Amen originally suspected that the signal was simply reflected back from Earth, but quickly realized that that was impossible due to how strong the signal was as well as how far it traveled. In 2017, scientist Antonio Paris claimed the signal came came from radioactive comet moving in the area. The scientific community immediately debunked this claim as the comet's path did not cross the telescope at the time of the signal. To this day, no one has a good explanation of where this signal came from. So what exactly was the WOW signal? Was it simply a quark in deep space? Or do you think it was something more paranormal in nature? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification button if you want to see more paranormal content like this. And remember, keep your mind sharp and your eyes open. Thank you.